with all my friends that we grew up together, that's what we wanted to do. We said we was going to make it in football. So I really dug in deep and started to play, and I really started to see God open a lot of doors for me. You don't know. It's the unknown. You don't know where you're going to get drafted to. You don't know what around. You don't know anything. Only thing you can do is train as hard as you can, put sweat and tears in the bucket, and, and pray that you go where you want to go. Where I'm from, from Temple, Texas, grew up in a small town, and you know, we're not really having a lot. Father's in, you know, in jail, and there's nothing you can do about that. My mom is always, you know, number one in my heart, but never really had the best of relationships with her, but we're trying to get that. My grandparents, my Anime Harris and John D. Harris, they shaped me to be man. Being on time and always looking the man in the eyes, shaking his hand firm. That was through my granddad's strength. I was actually in special needs classes growing up, so I had a lot of a lot of a lot of doubters. People thought I was slow, but I graduated high school. I am so much faster, so much explosive than I ever seen in my my years of just playing ball football. Here. Okay. Throws to Seastrup and Lake Seastrup. It's loose. The rookie from Baylor has a Redskin touchdown. You can't just get satisfied once you get there. You got to keep going. Jay Rice never took a day off. Tim Smith never took a day off. Ray Lewis never took a day off. That's why they played so much. That's why they were respected. If I have kids one day, I can tell them this is this is what your dad did.